Welcome back to Hermitcraft. All right. Well, let's see. It is 6.05 in the morning as I'm recording. Yes, I am way late from what I want to usually be doing, but I have extenuating circumstances. Uh, specifically, uh, as of right now at the beginning of this recording, I have been smoke-free for 53 consecutive hours, which is kind of a record for me. It's about the best I've done in almost a year. So, here's hoping I can continue at it, and I'm going to continue updating my progress on this. In the meanwhile, I need to update some work on the uh, big logo slash... Uh, eventual gateway into the vault up on the surface here uh yeah because i got a good start but i gotta do something like with the lighting and you know i should have brought a dog on uh shears with me but oh well The only problem with using the carpet is it sticks up a little bit, but I think I can live with that. So, let's see. If I put this stuff um, let's see. We have light, and then one, two, three, four, five, and then another light. Something like that kind of a pattern. Throughout, all the way across. And that should take care of that. But there is another thing here. And that is to do mostly with the center of this place. Which is why I got these lapis blocks out. I'm not sure that I want to have wool throughout here. I'm thinking the lapis might be good for showing the difference between the bulk of the logo and the part of it that is going to be the actual vault tech elevator heading downward into the vault. Yeah, something like that. Now, this is about as close of an approximation as I can get. Now, for elevator inspiration here, let me just say that for inspiration, what I really want to achieve is something like the vault elevator in Vault 111 in Fallout 4. That's the sort of thing I'm looking to try to do here. And, uh, yeah, this doesn't really look like that. But it's the best I can do on this scale. I mean, uh, it would have to be really, really huge to do it right. To do it genuinely right. But, yeah, something like this here. So, now the next step. is to get an elevator shaft dug out here. Yeah. Yeah, I'm doing terrible at this. But it's starting to shape up a little bit ish, sort of, kind of. All right. It'll be easier to maintain some control with digging once I get to working on the stone here. All 
Alright, this is... This is a decent start. What I need to do now is uh, get these coordinates. 225 by minus 698. Oh, wait a minute. Don't leave the big space dark. Because that's a dumb thing to do. 225 by minus... Oh, doggone it. I just looked at that. Now I need to go look at it again. 225 by minus 698. All right. And yes, someday this event, this uh, ugly, fugly shack on top will be going away. It's a temporary thing, but yeah. All right. All right, where am I at here? 194 minus 702. Okay. There's my 698. And now I need 225. There's 3, 4, 5. That's 05. Oh. Pardon the F3 numbers. I know it makes the screen look kind of cluttered, but I need it for a moment. Two twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. All right, right there. Now I can turn that off and head up back to the top and bring that shaft all the way down to that level. And that will give me where the elevator is going to actually come down to. So I'm going to go ahead and get this dug. I'm also going to get the lighting in here and get rid of the torches. And then I'll be back. Okay. There's my elevator shaft. A little piece of daylight at the top there. Now I need to get this thing connected with the rest of the place. So I need to dig this out. And put in a proper corridor like I have out here. Like so, with the diorite ceiling and the lamps and so on. So, I'm going to get that taken care of. And uh, this basically is where... Well, when the big bad wolf day comes. And they drop the bombs. This is the main entry into the vault. Now, somewhere along in here, there's going to need to be some kind of a sorting area because some folks go down further into the experimental residences and we'll have to figure out some kind of a situation for that. Perhaps something rude and crude like a sudden drop. I don't know. But uh, we'll get something figured out eventually no real hurry just yet i mean so far the big bad wolf is well there's no sign of the bad wolf just yet but sooner or later and that means the vault needs to be ready for it anyway i'm gonna get work on this co corridor here anyhow here's our uh, corridor and the elevator shaft, I've dug it down one block from all the rest because basically once the thing comes down, the floor will be level with the top of the elevator surface. And yes, by the way, uh, for those who have suggested such or are about to suggest such, yes, I will more than likely be contracting out the elevator design and construction just simply because I don't think I have the patience for such things right now. I mean, uh, 
the the quit smoking thing is bad enough as it is. And uh, if you've ever had to do it, you know what I'm talking about. It's, oh my God, my brain is all over the place today. And uh, it's, it's really something of a problem managing to stay focused on anything for more than a couple of minutes. So, yeah, this may seem like a short episode to you, but to me, it's 400 years long. And uh, I'll see if I can't do better in upcoming episodes. But for right now, today, thanks for watching. Take it easy. I am out of here.